welcome back to my channel so i'm finally back i'm really about to get like hella consistent i have so much shit coming up like it's ridiculous but yeah today's just gonna be like really quick simple get ready with me chit chat da -da -da -da, whatever everyday makeup this is basically how i like beat my face like like every day like i don't wear makeup every day but this is just like what i do what i do i'm just about to get started on this so I literally just woke up, I've just taken a shower. And yeah, so I'm about to do my hair, I'm gonna do my makeup. I'm gonna be doing like my like go-to everyday glam makeup look. This is just pretty much what I do every day, like during the daytime. If I go to the club or like anywhere like special, it'll obviously be like a little bit different, but yeah, pretty much every day. This is what I do. It's two o'clock. Kind of got my day started a little late today. <clears throat> I was out hella late last night. Like I had a training session at like seven o'clock this morning that I missed because I just couldn't wake up. Just couldn't fucking do it. So, um, yeah. So I'm just gonna curl. I'm. I don't know. I usually sleep with my hair, like when I have my hair curly, I sleep with it in like a curl, um, like this band thing that keeps my hair curly while I sleep, but shit, when I got home last night, I was just like, I was so tired, I was like, I'm gonna do fuck, I just put a bonnet on, so my curls like, look like shit, but I'm just gonna curl my hair real quick and like pin it up, like pin curl it basically. I'm gonna be using like pins like these, like this. And we're gonna ignore the fuck out of my nails because I'm going to Cancun next week and I'm gonna get them done before I go to Cancun. So there's gonna look like shit right now. Okay. Okay. So I'm just gonna start. They're so fucking bad. It's like peeling, like, it's disgusting. literally disgusting but anyways so <clears throat> i'm gonna spray a little bit of this pink um glosser shine shit mm. just brush that through it smells good it smells good but yeah so y'all i literally just got the text um, a couple, I mean, not the text, I got the email last night that I got accepted into school for, like, the past, like, month or two. I've been, like, thinking, like, I want to go back to school and stuff like that. So, I got, the I got the email confirmation I got accepted. It's a community college in LA. Um, it's, like, 10 minutes away from my house. But I was going to school in Texas, so I was just, like, transfer over, basically, and, um, and stuff like that. So yeah, that's basically how I'm just, what I'm about to do to my hair, like curl it and then just pin it up. But yeah, so I was majoring in business and I, I'm like in the process of opening a store, um, like a beauty bar. So not that I like, it, I've gotten very, very far, like without, um, it's like a business education and I still to this day don't necessarily need one. Like I don't need it by any means, like I've gotten... Like, I could go as far as I want without it. Um, it's just the fact, I think, for me, it's more so. This bitch is, like, not that hot. She's, like, not even curling my fucking hair. I'm so confused. Oh! Why have I had this bitch unplugged? <laughs> oh, my God. I was like, why this shit not hot? y'all i'm so tired i'm not tired but i'm just like i hate like when i stay out late it just it just genuinely makes me like um like no i feel like i don't be my best the next day so that's how i feel right now i just feel like i'm still like exhausted like 
anyways. So yeah. Um, so I just, I think I kind of just wanted like, um, as far as like school, like I think I just, I think I just want like the title of being like, like young, black, educated, like businesswoman. You know what I'm saying? Like, not to say that I'm not, I wasn't smart. Not to say that I'm like, I'm not smart without school, but it's just like the fact of just saying like, oh, like I have a degree. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how I feel. Honest to God, like that's how I feel about school, like in general. Like, I'm, I just feel like unless you're like going to school to be like, um, like a doctor or a lawyer or like some shit like that. I just feel like other than so I ended up going ahead and filming my um, I did it off camera because my camera ended up dying I'm telling y'all like I have just getting home so fucking late just really fucked me up Like I was not I did not do what the fuck I needed to do But anyway, so yeah, my camera wasn't charged and so then yeah, and then also this is like not even every day for me like i would not sit up here and do this every single day and do my whole face and makeup like i'm telling you my curl band is what the fuck i use i would just unravel it my hair would just be curly but you know it's okay like last night was just a little you know whatever so it is what it is but now that that's done we can get on to the makeup so I went ahead and moisturized my face and everything earlier after I took a shower and stuff like that. But I do like to go in with this um, Clinique Moisture Surge 72 Hour Auto Replenishing Hydrator. It's a long ass name, but yeah. I just like to put this on underneath my makeup because I feel like my makeup just goes on so fucking smooth, y'all. Like so fucking smooth. But yeah. Anyways, what were we talking about earlier? I think I was talking about school. Yeah. I'm going back. Mainly because, like I said, I just want to say that I have a degree. Like, I really don't need it. It hasn't been something that's like... It hasn't been like, oh, I haven't been able to do this. Or I haven't been able to do that because I don't have a degree. Or I haven't I didn't go to school for it. Like, no. <laughs> no, I've been very much so able to do whatever um whatever i just think i just want to i just want to say i have a degree i think that's what it is um i use like two different um two different um, foundations mainly because they're i have not been matched for a foundation in a long ass time so they're actually like very much so off as you can see they're literally like two completely different colors one is a little bit too dark and one is a little bit too light so when i mix them together it's going to like that looks so bad <laughs> it looks so bad it looks so bad but when i blend it together it's not gonna look crazy i promise but um but anyways yeah, I think I just really want to be able to say that I have, like, a degree and stuff like that. Just to say that I have it. And then also, like, my mom was, like, really, really big on school. Like, she's a doctor and everything. So she's, like, you know, when I told her from the jump that I didn't, that I did want to not finish school, it, like, broke her heart. And she was just, like, couldn't understand, like, why. But I just basically, I think my whole thing was, like, I just really wanted to prove a point to my my family that like you really don't need a college degree to be like successful especially like ow especially like you know this generation and just like with social media and like everything that we have going on now it's like there's so many different ways to you know make money and you can make a lot of money on the internet but I, it's she's definitely like realizes now and like sees like how big it is so enough punishment for her um <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and finish school just because I just want to say that I fucking finished school. Like, that's really it. Like, I just want to say that I did it. I don't really care. Uh, my eyebrows are microbladed, so I really do not do, like, a whole, whole bunch to them. I just kind of, like, if anything, I just, like, darken them up with this pencil. 
because when I was getting them done, like I wanted them to be so light and I just did not want her to make my eyebrows fucking black, like naturally. Like I wanted to like actually have to fill them in and stuff like that. But yeah, now I just kind of like, just make them darker or like whatever. But yeah, y'all, <clears throat> so this summer is going to be like my, basically like my goal for the summer is to um, get my store opened, be hella consistent with YouTube, like YouTube, 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 and school. Ow. <sighs> Anyways, be hella consistent with YouTube and then um, school. Those are like the two like very important things to me this summer. All I want to focus on, all I really want to do. So, yeah. Okay. So, then when I get my foundation, like all blended, just want to go through and just make sure everything is like evenly blended out. Um, I'm going to use, I've been using this Makeup Forever Ultra HD Concealer for years. It's the shade Y41, I think. I don't know, but I'm fucking obsessed. This is the old packaging. Like, I haven't gotten um, the new, like, packaging yet. But it's the Y41 concealer. I fucking love this concealer. Um, I think my, I think I just like the color of it more than anything. Like, I really haven't, I really don't even really pay too much attention to, like, the formula and the consistency of it. I mean, obviously, I think, I think I like it because I've been using it for so long. But it's really just, like, the color for me. Like, I just love how it's, I just think it's a good it's a good shade for my skin tone because I feel like a lot of makeup companies will come out with like all these concealers or whatever and there just aren't any like good like yellow undertone concealers and I could be wrong if you guys know some like please let me know please 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 let me know because I really want more but I just feel like they don't do a good job of coming out with like yellow tone concealers now this is the one i like to add on to it this is the sephora make no mistake high coverage concealer i only put on a little bit of this because concealer i only put on a little bit of this because i did not match it correctly to my skin color so it is extremely too light and it makes it just it just looks a mess if i put this on by itself so just to add like a little bit of extra brightness i just add on like a little i literally add on like the smallest fucking drop because I've made so many mistakes and just being like, oh, let me just put on like, and it just looks a fucking mess. It just does not look good. So, um, just because I wet my beauty blender a while ago, I just want to get a little more wet and just like, taking some Fix Plus, the little mini bottle. I'm just gonna blend that out underneath my eye. But yeah, y'all, first of all, like, let me just fucking tell y'all how stressful this coronavirus has been for me and my business. Like, I, first of all, have been waiting on packages for, like, the longest. And then the worst part about that, the worst part about everything is that, like, usually, like, my vendor, when I order something and she ships it out to me, it'll I literally, like, if I order something on, like, a Sunday to them, it's already Monday they ship it out immediately i have it by wednesday like the shipping is very 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 fast okay so i'm waiting on here obviously like i'm waiting on here i ordered like a special order because i'm going on vacation and i want like some special like curly ass hair i literally ordered the hair like friday yeah i ordered the hair friday and i just got the fucking confirmation that my hair is not going to be here until march 9th and I leave March 10th. I leave March 10th. My hair appointment was is for March 10th at 2 o'clock. And my flight, I have to be at the airport at 6. And I, my hair needs to be colored. So, like, I still haven't told my hairstylist because I just feel like she's going to be so, like, irritated. Like, you know, like, because that's just like, what the fuck? You know, I have not told her yet. But I am going to tell her at some point. I'm just going to be like, dude, I'm going to have to drop it off to you on Monday. And, like, I'm sorry, but, like. I'm just sorry, like, 
it's just been it's just been so fucking annoying and then like i saw that video of this man it was going viral on twitter he was like trying to spread the virus like like they were in china and it was like a video it was like video surveillance of him like licking his hand and like coughing in his hand and like touching everything in the elevator like perp like intentionally purposely like spitting in his hand and rubbing it on like it, it was so disturbing to watch because it was just like you know like i've never seen no shit like that before like you know what i'm saying like i was just like what the fuck like it, it was just it was very 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 disturbing and i was just like okay like this is all right anyways uh i'm about to go and um set my contour i don't know i think my camera cut out i don't fucking know at this point i'm about to throw it across the fucking room but anyways so yeah highlight contour overall like blend together to get it to look like one um and then i'm gonna take my bronzer this is in the shade dark deep from mac and i'm just gonna like bronze up my face a little bit more boom period period boom and then i'm going to do a little bit of blush i remember for years i fucking hated blush still kind of do but i just feel like i just be feeling like my face like needs it so here we are um yeah I feel like I do my makeup out of like in like a really weird order like I'm not even gonna lie to you I feel like I do my makeup in such a weird ass order <sighs> I don't really give a fuck though I'm using my highlighter this is from Stila this is a heaven's hue highlighter I've been using this for a long time I really really like it just gives me like a really nice pretty like natural glow that like I feel like just goes really well with my skin tone I have that issue with some highlighters. They'll just be like a little too like, I don't know. Like a lot of people, say, honestly, a lot of people say that one about the soft and gentle highlighter from MAC. But a little trick, I will put on like bronzier highlighters, like um, brownish yellow highlighters. And then I'll top it off with like a pale or like a white highlighter to kind of make it like a little bit more like dramatic, if that makes sense. Like I would never use soft and gentle like flat on by itself as like a highlighter like i would not do that to myself like ever no um yeah that's out and then for eyeshadow i really like i said this is every day i do not do not like to stress myself out with um with eyeshadow so i just like lightly tap on like a base like kind of like the same skin color same color as my skin tap on like a little base and then that's it just so that it's like even if that makes sense um so as that my face is setting everything as far as like my face is like set so i'm just gonna go in with this dewy finish um spray from nyx because it's summer it's like it's like nice outside i kind of want my skin to look a little wet and then i'm gonna pop on my lashes real quick um i'm wearing the lashes are gonna be in the shade blush from my brand shop she's the plug.com okay honey period like let me show you all the packaging as well like those had lashes in them these have lashes in them too fuck it packaging comes with a cute ass mirror which is very fucking convenient if i'm out and i need to pop on lashes i always keep them in a case and i can just like boom stick them on like that so it's super super convenient very very cute shop she's the plug.com okay here i'm gonna show y'all the look when i get these on i am that person i use hair glue to put my lashes on like that duo shit is out for me honey like that shit is ghetto like real life ghetto i do i have not used duo lash glue in like years i've been i've been using hair glue for like years now and it's just it's my life chipotle is my lot oh, chipotle sounds so fucking good right now i want chipotle 
I'm going to Cabo. Me and my friend are going to go to Cabo Cantina. Probably will still go, like, later because I want to drink. But I want Chipotle. Sorry. Where's the... Oh. Ugh. I was like, where's the lash glue? Where's the lash glue? Okay. I need to get another one. It's, like, very ghetto. I'm, like, running out of it. It's, like... Barely any product in there. This is nasty. I need to get another one. Okay. So I just get it, line it up with the glue. And I, I like this about the lash glue is that you don't have to fan it and let it dry like regular lash glue you just like put it on and then you actually want to put it on as quick as you possibly can because you don't want to let the lash glue start drying or the hair glue as i should say you don't want it to start drying before it gets on to like the lash line like you want it to dry on your lash and honey baby girl i'm serving okay like and this is not a lash for everyone. Like, this is not a look for everyone. Like, it, it is just not. That's why I have five different styles that you can choose from. Three out of the five are 25 millimeters. And the other two are just regular lash lengths. So if this is not something like, a lot of people are like, that's not like everyday glam. Like, honey, this is my everyday glam. Okay? You do you and I'm going to do me. Like, this is, this is my everyday and then some days I even don't always wear these lashes. Like some days I will wear like more natural lashes. Like it really just depends. I think it depends on like where I'm going and like the occasion. But like I want to get some pictures for Instagram today. Like I want to feel like a bad bitch today. Baby, when I pop these lashes on, it's like I'm unstoppable. Like I am unfucking stoppable. Like period. Okay, so now I'm just going through and just touching everything up and just like making sure everything's like, you know, to my liking. I'm just going to add like some lip gloss. I usually do like the brown lip liner with the nude pink in the middle, but lately I have just been loving like plain clear gloss, like no lip liner, like no nothing. Like last summer, the nude the brown liner and the nude lip was like my go-to i think this summer i'm going to be like all over just clear gloss okay so i'm gonna be using my morphe continuous setting mist i fucking love this shit all right so the face is pretty much done for the most part now i just gotta finish off on the hair so now it's just super super simple i just basically take out the pins I mean, it's really not that easy. I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'd be fucking struggling. See, like, this shit don't ever want to let me be fucking great. Just take the pins out. I have some bobby pins in here. Because I was running out of pins. I need to go to the beauty supply store and buy some more. Ooh, 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 Don't need y'all seeing my goodies. No. Nah. But it's hard because I don't I be feeling like I be missing pins. Like I'm the type to go out in public and have a whole fucking curl in the pin curl in the middle of my fucking head in the back. Like dead ass. Dead fucking ass. I use like one pink one. There's like still bobby pins, curls back there. The bobby pin ones are the worst because it's black and you can't really see it. Okay, so now I just have to like fix the top of it so that it looks natural. Um. Sometimes my hair just like will really just like not cooperate with me and just like 
does not want to see me be great. Like, literally. I don't know if I should take the big brush and brush through it. Kind of scared. Kind of scared. Okay. So I'm just going to take the hot comb and comb that out. See, it's, I don't want to brush through it all the way because I just feel like I'm going to brush my fucking curls out. This, it's always this side don't ever want to fucking cooperate, like, cooperate. Damn, I could not say that word. Cooperate. Whatever. This side always want to be on some fucking weird shit. Ow! <sighs> Y'all, this is a struggle, okay? This whole video was a fucking struggle. Okay. See, like, this side, this is my favorite side. This is my favorite side. I put on a gray Rilla Life hoodie. Hope you guys can like see. I have on some of my black biker shorts and then my, I had some pink Gucci socks with my Air Forces. They're like dirty, I really need to get some new ones. But um, yeah, this is just streetwear. I'm just going to like a little, like bar in Hollywood and like just chill like for the day like it's nothing like too crazy so yes so that's it I put on my Miss Dior perfume by Christian Dior it smells so good I think I'm gonna go put on some hoops downstairs but yeah like this is just basically it um that's basically it this concludes the video thank you guys so much for watching like comment subscribe sorry if it was like a little bit all over the place I'm gonna get a lot better my fucking camera just really wasn't charged so i kept having to like stop and charge it so like yeah sorry my sincere apologies but yeah so like comment subscribe more videos coming soon i'm going to cancun next week i'm gonna try to vlog that for you guys as well hopefully i'll have this video up before no stop i will have this video up before i go to cancun like gotta speak shit into existence you feel me so yeah so whoop, that's it this concludes the video thank you for watching i think i already said that but yeah 